This is number three of the edition of 25 of the OM44K Lawrence Tuber signature model. That would be me. Um, serial number is 1512087. And um, this, this particular one has some very, very nice, very fine figuration on it. Uh, lots of flame. Um, also a very nice uh, stripe on either side of the back stripe there. Um, nice flame on the sides, headstock overlay. Um, the Spanish cedar neck. You, you'll notice with Spanish cedar that it's, uh, the grain structure is a little bit different from mahogany. Uh, on a typical mahogany neck, you'll see that the, the grain is shorter. Um, Spanish cedar, uh, we, we use this for lightness. It gives an airy quality, almost a classical guitar quality to the sound. Um, very nice uh, top on this. Uh, nice combination of close grain and, and wider grain. Uh, I find often that the, the slightly wider grain gives you a little more fullness early on in the, in the, the life of the guitar. Uh, as time goes on, it st starts to even out. Um, but I'm uh, enjoying the sound of this particular instrument. It's, uh, they're always fun to play. You know, it's uh, these, these kind of guitars with the koa, there's a, it not only projects out, but it also comes back and embraces you so that you can really enjoy the playing of it from both ends of the spectrum. Your audience enjoys it, you enjoy it. Um, in my case, I enjoy it, you know, and, and it's remarkable that I get to sit here and play a whole batch of them, an edition of 25. Guitars with a great deal of character, bringing the vintage Martin vibe into a modern guitar. Um, I like to just think of the, the sonic character of Koa is, is very three-dimensional, much like the grain um, itself of the wood has this three-dimensionality to it. Um, you really look at it and you, you see depth to it. Um, so uh, just a very enjoyable instrument, a, a lot of character.